Hi YouTube, it's me Tiffany again. So in my last video I talked about, I introduced myself and I talked about the reasons why I wanted to go natural and how I was starting to go natural, how I'm only two months post relaxer, I'll be three months the next week I'll be three months post relaxer I talked about when I first got my first relaxer and I also talked about what my goals are and how I wanted to share my journey as I am transitioning into um, being natural as you can see right now we're in a protective style this is a twist out um I did it this morning I washed my hair well I co-washed my hair this morning that's what I've been doing lately because my hair gets really really dry like to the point where like my relaxed ends break off a little bit since I've been co-washing it that has stopped it still breaks but not as much which I am grateful for thank goodness um see if I can show you my hair like I said I'm only almost three months post relaxing so all this right here is natural hair like I said I did a twist out I did it on wet damp here and I took it out when it was almost dry but let's see if you can see all of this right here, it's about right here, that's all, I think it's right here, I can't, I know you guys probably can't see that, that's all natural hair. And what I see in my hair so far is, which you probably can't tell the difference because my hair is kind of wavy from the natural style, well from the, um, sorry, the twist out style, is, it's really curly, like my hair kind of goes like this, and really tiny little curls from what I can make out so far, like I said, I only got like about that much new growth so but it kind of looks like I saw a little piece earlier and I was like oh that looks like my natural hair if you see this little piece this little fella right here that's how my natural hair is starting to curl like can you see that I'm trying to get the rest of my hair out the way so you guys can see that yes that's how my hair is starting to look so I'm kind of excited and then I talked to my mom she said my hair was mostly curly when I was younger so it sounds like I probably had like a 4A maybe 3C I'm gonna go with 4A here but we don't know we only know as time goes along anyway right now I have my younger sister Courtney with me say hi Courtney hello and isn't her hair gorgeous she's in braids <laughs> right now it's really I love it Michael she's actually gonna do my hair probably tonight or in the morning most likely in the morning getting kind of sleepy <laughs> you probably can't tell though <laughs> But, um, she's, she's actually natural. And the weird thing is, I didn't even know it. Um, I'm in college, so I don't live at home. She's still in high school, so she lives at home with my mom. And I saw her straightening her hair one day. And I was like, wow, your hair straightens really good. Did you just get a perm? And she's like, no, I've been natural for, <laughs> how long have you been natural? Since the summer of my freshman year. So I had to say like a year and a half. And, like, mm -hmm. I wish her hair was in the braids because her hair is probably, what, how long? Well, you talk to them. My you, hair? <laughs> you tell them the texture of your hair. Well, my hair, it's, like, I would say it's, like, a messy curl. It doesn't go into, like, little ringlets that people have, like, the little cute little spiral. It's, just like, curls everywhere. It's kind of like this, but imagine just everywhere and more fuller. It's, okay, I can rock a puffy style. Kind of like, what's his name from um, Boondocks? What's his name? Huey. Huey. That guy. Anyway, but, uh, <laughs> but yeah, right now it's in the transitioning. You know, and I, usually what I do is I either put weave in my hair. I'm a weave girl all day. I love it. But I either put weave or I put braids in, you know, just to give it a break. But I, and I can, it also helps me to see the transition or see how much of my hair has been growing from the braids. And I don't do it too tight to the point that my um, ends come out or like my edges or anything. You know, I just do it enough so that I won't touch or anything. But yeah, you can see it. I'll take it out in the point so you can see it too. <laughs> I pulled it back tight. Yeah. Okay. Like a dreadlock. Go shot it. Anyway, but um, see? And it's easy to wear. You do shake it out every day, kinda go like this. If you wanna put a little spray in it, get to go. Just simple as that. That's cool. And guys, I have not had weave in my hair since I was in eighth grade. I've had weave my hair maybe the maximum three, four times. And don't get me wrong, people who wear weave, I love their hair. I love weaved hairstyles. Only thing with me is from what I remember since I was in eighth grade when I um, had weave in my hair, and that was about, what, seven, eight years ago, is my hair itched like crazy. I have dry hair. My scalp usually always itch anyway, which is weird because I have really oily skin on my face. You can probably see it. 
Um, <laughs> but my scalp gets so dry and flaky at times. Oh, like I have to wash my hair no more than like seven days. Like every seven, no less than every seven days. It gets really itchy. Usually I try to co-wash like every three days because it gets, like I said, it gets itchy. And I just remember the last time I had weaving my hair, I had like the little box braids. Oh my <laughs> gosh. I was like, I was like this the whole time. So my sister's been wanting to do my hair forever and I want to get my hair break because it is starting to break a little bit. Like I said, like in the middle part right here, I don't know, you probably see it's really thin. It's starting to break off where the line of demarcation is. You know, the line where your relaxed hair meets your new growth. And I just want to get my hair break. Not to mention, I am taking more loads at school this semester. So this will give me a chance to just wake up in the morning, you know, get dressed and go without having to spend so much time trying to blend my new growth in with my relaxed hair. It'll save me time. So... I'm gonna try it out and I hope and I hope it works. I will definitely update you guys and show how it looks and how well I'm keeping up with it. My goal is to try to keep it in for at least a month and a half, two months. The longest I ever had weave my hair was like two and a half, three weeks. <laughs> I took that mess out. Like I was itching. But we'll see how it works and I'm excited and I can't wait to show you guys. Bye.